now turn to section 3. Section 3. You will hear a conversation about a student thesis. First, you have some time to look at questions 21 to 24. Now listen carefully and answer questions 21 to 24. Come in please. Good afternoon. Oh, I am sorry. Is it Professor Lee's office room? No, it is room 640. His new room number is 614 on the right of this corridor. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Come in, please. Good afternoon, Professor Lee. Good afternoon. Come in, please. I remember our tutorial time is at two o'clock, right? Really? Oh, I am so sorry. I remember it is at half past one. So I... I go to common room to wait for 30 minutes, OK? No, no, I'm free now. Let's begin. I am so sorry. That doesn't matter. So, how about your work? In fact, Professor Lee, can I get an extension of time to hand in my work? I mean, I hope to extend my thesis deadline. James, you know extension is usually given only for medical or accident reasons. So what's your problem? You have a good beginning with your draft, isn't it right? Yes, while I... I'm having too many reading materials to read. Too many? How many? Besides academic journals, I have about 15 books to read next month. I don't think I can finish them. Oh, darling, you do not need to read them all. What do you mean? I mean, you can choose some parts of these books which can help your work. Really? Could you give me some suggestions? Sure. Now look at questions 25 to 30. Now listen carefully and answer questions 25 to 30. Do you bring your reference book list? Yes, I take it. Let's see. First, the book by Bayer. I think it is really worth reading. Read it all? Yes. The topic of the book is nearly the same field with you. OK. I'll read Bayer's book. The next author is Oliver. I heard that his argument is very strong, but the book is a little difficult. You are right, but I still recommend you to know about his argument, which will give you a lot of help. Fine. Do you think I should read Billy's book? About Billy. I have to say his work is very good, especially his research method, but... You do not need to read it now. Right. The last author is Andrew. How about his book? In my opinion, the one by Andrew says the research findings. I mean, his last part is very excellent, clear and persuasive. I agree with you. I'm reading the book now. Great. How about others? I suggest you finish these books next month and then we will talk about others, OK? OK. Have you begun your research work? Yes. How are things going? That's OK, except the research method. 
What's wrong with the method? I have made some interviews. Yes. But I found they couldn't give me the data I need. Who are the interviewees? Some are our classmates, and others are schoolmates. Oh no, James. It's better for you to interview some professionals. Do you think it is better for me to change another research method, such as questionnaire? I don't think you will have enough time to design it and then analyse your research data. That will waste you a lot of time. You're right. And pay attention to your reference. Reference books. No, I mean you should make clearly about what reference books you read, and then write them after your thesis. Okay, I'll make them clear. Fine. I hope to see your work quickly. I hope too. Thanks for your help, Professor Lee. That's okay. See you next time. See you. This is the end of section three. You now have half a minute to check your answers.